All right. Young Witch. Smugglers. Mm -hmm. Okay, I like that he has the four first. Um, mm -hmm. Because I got to see that he didn't go Young Witch here. So I can actually reasonably safely avoid uh, over committing to um, any potential defenses, which are plentiful here. Uh, I, I don't think Young Witch is going to be super great in any case. Um, I probably want to go with mainly a fishing village into... Yeah, I definitely want smugglers as well. Um, and uh, it's important to get it second so that when he smuggled there, he smuggled the smugglers. The extra smugglers won't be so hot. Um, but, okay, we want a ghost ship. And we're going to want watchtowers at some point. I would like a horn of plenty already. Um, and surprisingly, there's no... Give me the ghost ship. Um, Shantytown is also going to also gonna help out quite a bit. Um, would I like a gold? Would I like a gold? The big thing at this point is to get the, uh, the engine up and going. Which is going to mean more fishing villages... Um, more cards to gain stuff with, and yeah, this is fine. Uh, some shanty towns at some point. Warehouses potentially as well. And he's going to get a big horn of plenty here. Probably three pile endings are going to are going to be very, very possible. So we're going to have to watch out for that. Yeah, give me the fishing village. I really need fishing village. Fishing village! Um, but he's definitely in really good shape here. Um, having gotten the engine up a bit faster. Let's see, I could buy and trash an estate, which would help out for trade routes, do stuff at the end game, but nah, doesn't make much difference to me. Really want to get this engine up, so... We're going to get those things. Mm -hmm. He's able to smuggle the shanty town. And I'm going to get another one here. Mm -hmm. I will pick up a gold because I think it's going to be important in the long run. And for now, I want to do mm -hmm. more. Uh, if I have plenty of actions to do this. Yeah, okay. Um, but I am I'm going to need... We've got to watch out for three pile endings, which is part mm -hmm. of why I wanted the gold. But... Okay, ghost ship first, because I want to play that no matter what. Shanty town, because it'll help the Horn of Plenty, potentially. Um, what, I can get a tribute or a warehouse? Uh, I think I want the warehouse, actually. This is only up to seven, so I can go ahead and gain and expand with it. That'd be pretty nice. And Horn of Plenty. Mm -hmm. um, and I really have to look at, at getting points relatively quickly. Um, he smuggles another mm -hmm. warehouse. Interesting. I'm going to get a ghost ship and uh, do I want another shanty town, a watchtower or what I could already 
take a duchy, but it seems a little bit premature as there's seven games to get through. Um, I could get another gold. I could get another ghost ship. I think I want another shanty town. And now I think I definitely want the uh, the watchtower. Um, gotta play the watchtower first. It draws more cards. Uh, things are getting low. It's probably gonna end relatively mm -hmm. soon. He gets a province, so that's really important. Mm -hmm. Um, in fact, I almost feel compelled to start gaining duchies here. And a warehouse, please. Yeah, okay. Now, I have this interesting choice. I can either dunk the expand back and draw with the shanty town, or put the shanty town back with, say, the Horn of Plenty, and hope for a big turn next turn, which is what I want to do. Probably going to be expanding this gold into a province because I I really need the points at this point. Um, and I'm worried about him being able to, and he's just triggered a reshuffle, which is a little bit risky. Uh, but if he can, you know, get six here of these. Uh, okay. Scrap that plan. Uh, he has too many points for me to possibly be worried about that at this point, so I'm going to get another tribute and another watchtower here and hope, 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 hope that things work out. But they probably won't. He probably has me cooked here. Uh, I guess I'll get one of those, one of these, one of these, and just hope. He probably gets another province here. I need to get a mega turn, which quite frankly is pretty unlikely at this point. Um, fishing village, tribute, what do I get off that? Okay, watchtower, shanty town, tribute, warehouse, some stuff. Uh, I don't need the second warehouse at oh, the moment. Oh, I don't need the second shanty town. That's what I really don't need. Okay, now ghost ship. And unfortunately for me, he just has too many points, period. Um, so I'm going to get this big turn, and maybe I can get a few provinces, but a few provinces isn't enough, right? So that's annoying. And I'm going to assume I'm going to draw a copper back. Okay. Uh guess go ahead and expand this copper into like a trade route or something. He has one of those guys in hand. And I can smuggle away that tribute, which was maybe a mistake. Um, grab and expand and a province and a duchy. Um, yeah, but I'm not in good shape, and he can get this duchy here, smuggled, which is annoying. Tribute there, watchtower draw up, tribute, and tribute, and smuggle a duchy, ghost ship him. I can expand this shanty town into a duchy. Cop 
paper. We can expand the estate into a duchy. Nah, I don't want that on my deck. So I can gain a couple provinces here, but that's not going to be enough. Um, Do I, well, I need to gain the duchy so to block him out, but um, let's see. I've gained already one, two, three duchies, but I've given up an estate, which may have been a huge mistake. I should have counted better. That's eight points. That puts me on 22. Um, I mean, I'm not totally out of it, but I'm going to need more young witches. I can get the provinces later. Warehouses intro. Oh, he has the watchtower there. Two tributes is all he needs. Uh, or any number of other things. Mm -hmm. He gets an estate. Cool beans. We're going to play it this way. Warehouse. I probably don't need both watchtowers. Warehouse. Okay, now I don't have anything great to expand. I don't need anything there. Um, probably need a trade route and go after estates. And put that on my deck because I, I absolutely have to have this stuff to to give him curses at this point. Um, good. Good. What did he get last turn? Nothing. So I don't want the smugglers. He gets another curse. I continue to give him... Ah, only seven. Um... Let's see. I guess a gold, a shanty town, and a warehouse. Okay, I'm okay with him smuggling stuff, that's fine. This is fine too. Except if he can get a province, I'm dead. Or if he can get enough tributes, I'm dead. Well, that's probably the bigger. Or enough of these, but I'm just, just covered in every place. He can't quite end it here. And so he's going for estates, which might be a mistake. I don't know. I probably should have kept the smugglers that turn, huh? Okay. Ghost ship. Now another young witch. Okay, want to get rid of the duchy. Gold. Or maybe the watchtower. I should count my unique cards and play. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, I will have eight. 
I can gain two provinces and two estates, right? Yeah. Okay, he kept that, but I can sm smuggle an estate and then expand. Um, well, I can expand a gold into an estate. Oh, why, why would I do that? I can expand a copper into an estate, buy a province, and uh, no, I can expand a gold into a province. <sighs> if I expand a gold into a province, I can't buy a province. If I expand a copper into an estate, okay, ex expand, I need the Horn of Plenty to be able to gain the province, right? There's no way around that, okay. But I had it covered. And I just had the one point. Woohoo! So close. Great game. Uh, he stalled out hard at the end. Some of that is a little design, but mostly I got lucky. I think he got a little lucky early on, but wow, wow. There's a bunch of close endgame decisions, and it's just it's hard to make them. Uh, probably we each could have played better, but that is a great example of what Dominion's all about. Comments or questions on YouTube. Thanks very much.